Sales of existing homes fell harder than expected in February after hitting a decade high the month before. It's not because of lack of demand. Buyers are out, but there are obstacles in their way. Diana Olick has our story. Home shoppers out this spring are finding fewer listings and higher prices, and both are standing in the way of sales. February was the warmest in half a century, but sales chilled, falling hardest in the Northeast and only managing a small gain in the South. Here we have our master suite. Realtors say they're seeing far more potential buyers, but not even close to enough <laughs> listings to meet the demand. Supply is down over 6% from a year ago and has been falling now for nearly two years. Why? Well, for one, builders are only operating at about 70% of their normal production levels. They blame a lack of land and labor, as well as the rising cost of regulation for their slow and wobbly recovery. What we're seeing is actually the share of uh, new homes um, that comprise of all home sales is you know, only about 11 or 12 percent when it should be about double that. It should be about 24 percent. And normally, you know, that might not raise much of an eyebrow, but that should raise eyebrows now because existing inventory and existing home sales is also still pretty low. But it's not just the builders. Following the housing crash, investors scooped up bargain basement distress properties, adding four million single family homes to the rental stock. With rental demand still very high, they're not selling them back into the market as some had expected. Investors came in to get that cash flow and the cash flow remained very positive uh, and the price appreciation is just extra uh, gravy uh, that they are witnessing and they are saying they're going to ride out these price increases. Not only are investors not selling, they're buying more and they're using cash to do it. That leaves regular mortgage dependent buyers, especially first time buyers looking for a good deal, locked out. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Diana Olick in Washington.